Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to our channel. Thanks to your support, this channel can continue in our goal to spread awareness about mental health and psychology. You help us make psychology and mental health more accessible to everyone. Thank you for your support. Our personalities shape our lives and our decisions. It's what makes you, you. But what if your personality is lacking in certain areas that you'd like to improve? Could we develop a strong personality? Well, while we should love ourselves for who we are, you can indeed develop new traits and change parts of your personality. Your personality could be influenced by environmental factors, according to Gordon Allport, one of the founding figures of psychology. Allport's famous trait theory argues that our personality traits are indeed biologically determined, but formed by environmental experience. And according to psychologist Hans Eysenck's personality theory, personality could be understood by taking a look at several dimensions of an individual's whole behavior. So if you change your behavior, new traits can form and ultimately change your personality. Forever. Just kidding, not forever. That's why you're here, to learn which traits you can develop for a strong personality. So without further ado, here are five traits of a strong personality anyone can develop. Number one, focused on results. People with strong personalities are often successful. Why, you may ask? Well, one reason may be due to the idea that many of them are focused on the results rather than the process of it all. They are goal-oriented, so the results can drive them to work faster and take a look at the bigger picture. But it's best not to become too focused on the result. If you just focus on the end result, the process of your project could become compromised if you don't pay close attention to it. Number two. Confident. You may have heard confidence is key. Well, it is for a strong personality type. Confidence is an attractive trait for many, and it often leads to success. According to one study, those who are self-confident earn more money and grow in their career faster than others. Number three, enjoys deep conversations over small talk. Those with strong personalities don't have time to mess around with small talk. If there's something that can be solved quickly, they'll do so by getting to the point. Otherwise, they love to talk about real things in life and indulge in deep conversations. A study published in Psychological Science shows this habit is a good one to develop. Researchers found that individuals who take part in substantive conversations as opposed to small talk and unimportant topics had more feelings of satisfaction. Number four, self-motivated. Do you procrastinate? Do you have trouble keeping yourself motivated to complete your homework or other important tasks? Hmm, well, it's never too late to develop a new trait. Self-motivation is an extremely useful trait that strong personality types tend to have. As I said before, many with a strong personality are successful. Self-motivation may be a reason why. Number five, control of one's emotions. Emotions can cause a lot of chaos. Good chaos, bad chaos, they're a handful. If one can master how they react to their strong emotions, one may have less conflict in arguments. Has this ever happened to you? You're in a heated argument. Someone has just said the most insulting thing you've ever heard on the planet that is Earth. And with one raise of the eyebrow and a cheeky smile, you know you've had enough. You burst out with rude insults back, but you take it a little too far. Oops. If one has control over their emotions, they know that they must take a moment to pause and take a deep breath in order to not overreact. They need to think through how to best handle the situation and come up with a witty comeback, one that isn't too soul crushing, or just ditch the comeback and play it nice. Those with strong personalities don't fear saying the word no when needed, and they don't mind walking away if something isn't worth their time. So if that bully you're conversing with continues to grind your gears, just show them how strong of a personality you actually have and walk away. You can replay awesome comeback possibilities in your head tomorrow. So which traits are you going to work on? Will you practice changing your behavior in hopes certain traits will stick? What traits do you already have? Let us know in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to click the like button and share this video with someone who may enjoy it. Subscribe to Psych2Go and hit the notification bell icon for more content like this. And as always, thanks so much for watching.